CTV is on the air. Good morning, Krusty Crew. Macy, are you ready to play some volleyball today? No. Oh, okay. Today is Friday, May 3rd, and day three of the six day cycle. Please rise for the national anthem and the pledge to our flag. <laughs> pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Alpha students, for students taking any classes through Alpha, the due date for English writing assignments is Friday, May 17th by 3 p.m. All other Alpha work is due by Sunday, May 19th at midnight. No exceptions. The summer classroom session of D&D Driving School will be June 10th through June 21st, Monday through fi Friday from 8 to 11 a.m. The second session will run from July 22nd through August 2nd in room B112 at the Mifflin County High School. Please find a registration form in the guidance office and return it to the main office. Cost is $100 due the first day of class. Thank you. Students who are considering co-op in their senior year are reminded to complete a co-op application. Copies of the application are available in the guidance office and must be returned to the guidance office to be completed. Are you interested in practical nursing, nurse aid, CDL, or apprenticeship programs? The Academy offers many adult education programs right here in Lewistown. A representative will be at MCHS today at 9.30 to meet with students interested in learning about the different programs offered. Please sign up in the guidance office ahead of time. Mr. Carter is still in the lead with Mrs. Shear in a close second place. Other teachers still in the running are Ms. Gallo, Ms. Momenzada, Mrs. McElwain, and Mrs. Hartzler. If you have one of these teachers and you would like to see them get a pie in the face today, be sure to stop by the table at all lunches to make a donation. Attention seniors, if you are a resident of Menno or Union Township and you are planning on pursuing a post-secondary education upon graduation, you may be eligible for the Belleville Lions Club Scholarship. Applications can be found in the guidance office for this $1,000 scholarship. Completed applications are due to Mrs. Kennington by May 10th. The school store needs to start reducing inventory for the end of the school year. That means savings for you. While supplies last, Snyder's pretzels are four for a dollar, freeze-dried fruit and fruit leather are also four for a dollar, and Cape Cod kettle chips are just 10 cents a bag. Supplies are limited, so stop by soon. If you attended the tie-dyeing event and only plain white shirts were available, you may take your shirts, once they have been washed, to Lewistown Printworks to have the saying printed on the back of your shirt. They will build communities that care for the service. Thanks to everyone who came and helped make this event a success. And remember to wear your shirts on May 10th for Children's Mental Health Awareness Day. Attention Spanish Club members. Our next meeting will be on Wednesday, May 8th at 7.40 a.m. in Senior Betts' room A301. Please be sure to attend as this is our last meeting of the year. Nos vemos. It was a busy, busy day yesterday at MC Sports. Here's Seth. Yesterday at MC Sports, despite goalie Vivian Ressler with 17 saves, our girls lacrosse team lost to Belfont with a final score of 18-6. And boys lacrosse lost to Seelands Grove. Our boys baseball team beat Central Dauphin 3-1, and in softball, our girls won against Central Dauphin 1-0. And in 
Attention field hockey players. Anyone interested in playing field hockey for the 2019 season is asked to meet with Coach Sudam and Coach Hoffman. Next year's juniors will meet with the coaches May 9th from 415 to 515. Next year's seniors will meet May 16th from 415 to 515. The meetings will be held here at MCHS in room A110. Please make every effort to attend. Today in MC Sports, track and field gets dismissed at 10 for the Mountain Line Invitational. Softball plays Greencastle, getting dismissed at 12.30, and girls lacrosse plays Belfont, getting dismissed at 2.30. That's sports. Macy, what's for lunch? In the Husky line, Hoagie Day, Caesar salad, carrots, and milk. And in the griller, hamburger or breaded chicken sandwich. We have one final announcement. If you are playing volleyball today, be sure to report to the gym at your scheduled game time. If you are not there on time, you will be disqualified. That's all for the morning show. I'm Macy, and he's Ryan. Have a fabulous Friday, and good luck to all the teams participating in the volleyball tournament. Have a husky day.